Hey, what's happening, guys? My name is Murder You, and uh, here we are back with another video. We're going to talk about Resizable Bar, aka Sam Smart Access Memory, which is known for AMD. Uh, pretty similar technology, but uh, what Resizable Bar uh, is, is it's, it's a feature that, you know, communicates between your processor and your graphics card, uh, you know, primarily through the PCI Express like functions uh, in your CPU uh, and the way you know, the GPU requests is textures, shaders, and other assets from your CPU. Uh, these get stored into, you know, your graphics card, which is called the VRAM. Um, you know, basically before getting drawn to like the image, you know, cause that's, if you didn't know what, what the difference is, what CPU and GPU does. Um, but the VRAM does store, um, you know, these, these type of information in order for you to see these type of information. But, you know, back, before we had like six gigabytes of VRAM, it wasn't as necessary to have uh, this much access from the CPU to GPU. But communication is key, right? Just like in any relationship, just like the CPU and GPU, they need to talk to each other. So resizable bar, uh, instead of it speaking to each other with like, you know, 256 uh, megabytes, uh, you know, each time, right? So each little square is going to communicate. Um, it has basically full reign to you know, for the CPU to go ahead and use what it needs to use. And um, so how, how do you enable, you know, resizable bar, um, you know, basically these type of things you're gonna have to enable through, uh, you know, your BIOS uh, on your motherboard. So when you go into your BIOS, you're gonna have to go into, you know, for, for the ACES, it's actually really easy. You can enable it from the quick menu, it's on the top right, or you can go into, the deeper settings in there and you go and just turn it on uh when it comes to say other people who use gigabyte um you know there are other ways or other content out there that you can utilize to see where it is but mainly it's called for above 4g decoding um is what you need to turn on for it to utilize resizable bar now when it comes to you know amd it's actually really simple for you to Go ahead and enable. Uh, well, when you enable, it's you know Sam. Uh, it automatically gets enabled, usually inside AMD's um, you know adrenaline software, uh, it, or you could just turn it on. Like if it's not on, you turn it on, and then as enabled, there's nothing more you need to do. But when it comes to Nvidia, you're going to have to uh, use something called Nvidia Profile Inspector. Uh, but before we go check that out. You do need to just enable, you know, make sure it's on. So after you turn it on, go to your video control panel, turn it on. Uh, you're going to see it real quick. You know, it's going to say, hey, rebar is on. After that, we go into the NVIDIA Profile Inspector. Uh, so when we open up NVIDIA Profile Inspector, um, you're going to see that when I scroll down to the bottom here, um, you're going to see that I already have it on because it's I'm already going to optimize my PC, um, but on my stream PC. but on this right here if you don't have these certain things on then go ahead and just follow some things i do uh then go ahead and enable it and that's pretty much it so right after this we're, we're going to show some footage you know the difference between having a resizable bar aka sam on which i'm mainly using sam because of the fact that my stream my main pc is the 6800 xt um but you should see a performance boost as well with resizable bar when you do put it on but if we do side by side i force it off in the bios and i turn it on in you know um what's what you call it <laughs> I turn it on in in the in, in the bios as well so it's two footages so i'll go ahead and just let the um you know let the footage roll let, let the game gameplay show its um you know show show its numbers then we'll get back to it
So that's that's all I got for you guys today. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Uh, if you like the content, please go ahead and give it a like. You know, if you go ahead and uh, you know, and give, give a nice little you know subscribe button too, I'll greatly appreciate it. But you know, at the end of the day, everybody, you know, thank you for watching my video. Uh, hopefully this helps you guys out, give you a little bit more FPS, help your system run a little bit better. Um, and always, you know, be kind, be nice to each other, tell somebody love them, right? I'll see you guys next time. Peace.